I've been thinking about the good times. I've been sleeping through the long nights. I've been shining in the sunlight. I've been thinking how I'm all Hello YouTube family. So this is me in Clip and Climb, a place called Clip and Climb, where it's an activity where you um it's like a wall climbing activity. I've never done this before. I decided to give it a try. And yes, so this was where she was um, giving the instruction. The young lady here was giving an in, in instructions on how to clip and um, and how to unclip yourself when you are climbing. So this is me trying to climb. I have never done this before. This is my first time. I saw that kids doing it. I was like, mm, another parent doing it. I was like, okay, just one foot in front of the other, right? Just keep going. And little by little, and I kept moving up. And this was something like I was trying to encourage my kids to do it as well because most times they would just get halfway and jump down and just not really. Um, they just go halfway and come down. So I wanted to let them know that if mommy can do it, so can you so this is just like a, a a boost for my kids to like tell them that they can do it in back of my mind i was still like <laughs> i was so scared because i was going higher and higher okay the numbers showing below is is like a timer that you could um, especially if you're maybe you're competing with somebody else on the other wall you can just press it there's a there's a button at at the bottom of the wall then when you get to the top the first person that gets to the top will press the second button there so the fastest time wins but I just did that because I wasn't even competing against anybody I just did that for just for doing sake just to prove to them that they can do it too so I was almost at the top and I'm going to press it the other fear is letting go like actually letting go your head will you feel so lightheaded i felt so lightheaded like am i truly going to let go the feeling is amazing and scary at the same time and i did i was like oh so this thing actually held me down <laughs> oh my god it was so funny then with my little demonstration my son was able to do it my daughter as well too was able to do it so we we're so happy and they just kept um climbing going to different walls so that's why the training the short training is also very good so you can just do all those things on your own and go to different walls you can see that they have different walls here like i'm going to be attempting this green pole stuff very soon you see that very different and challenging and exciting clip and climb that's the name if you're anywhere in saskatoon you need to visit this place with your kids, even with yourself as well. It's good for team bonding in your office or your department, for friends. You can go there. And it's a one-hour section. So when you once you pay, I'll include the um, payments, um, how you pay uh, in, the, in the description box. It's a one-hour uh, section. So we are like three families here with their kids, even parents. The, everybody attempted every wall that they could that they wanted to so even though you don't want to attend you don't want to attempt any of this wall climbing and you just want the children your children you can still be around the um, area here but you won't be you they won't give you a um, the harness or what's that thing called yeah they won't give you but you can be around your kids cheering them on and um like i was taking pictures taking videos and like that so it's a fun activity man i would go here over and over again it makes you conquer your fears if you're afraid of heights i don't know if you want to push yourself to like want to do it you can but if you really have this phobia for heights mm, i wouldn't really advise you do so i don't even know if i was afraid of height or not but this really tested me mentally Physically, not so much, but let's say a little bit, but not so much phys physically, was mentally, like, I didn't even know I was able to even push myself this hard to, like, get to the top and just let go, release all your whole trust on this harness, and you're going to land down safely. That's 
an amazing feeling. Your head will just like becomes very light the moment you just step off. <laughs> your head becomes so light. Oh my gosh. That's so light. And the next clip is going to be me attempting, even when I wanted to do this, the um um what do they call them? The um people around us trying to help out if you're having any problem. They will help you clip. You're finding it difficult to clip yourself or not. They're going to help you. So I was like, I want to do this. He was like, are you sure? Anyway, he just said, good luck. The moment he said good luck, I was like, hmm. As a lot of people tried this and not really pull through. I was like, okay, let me give it a try. And I started going, man, you guys, this thing was higher than it looks. Every step I took it was higher than it looks. I was fighting with my mind here that, okay, you've proved to your kids enough that you could do it, that you can, whatever you put your mind to, that you can do it. I can just jump off from here. Well, I told myself, I want to do this, not just for them, but for me. <laughs> I don't know. I, I'm sure you understand. You have that feeling that you just want to do this. I've never done this thing before. I want to be able to do this and conquer it. So that was the feeling I had. I was, well, this was like mind over matter for me here. Every step. <laughs> I was trying to like motivate myself. Looking at this video and uh, making this voice over, I'm, I'm still smiling I'm, and um, I'm still in shock that I was able to do this. Hmm. It's really interesting what the mind can do if you put your mind to it. Not the, what the mind can do, what you can physically do when you put your mind to it. Yes, that's what I wanted to say. So I was like, hmm, just two more and I'll be done. That was it. And I was like, one more. Before I put one foot here, this particular pole was wobbling, like it was shaking. I just felt it was part of the obstacle course. I had a little rethink. I was like, no, let's do it. This is the last one. Let's do it. Let's do it. We can do it. Just to push myself forward. And I did it. You guys, I felt like, <laughs> maybe it was the same feeling who stayed... Did I say Hussein Bolt? God, <laughs> when he won any race, he wins. And I'm like, I felt so good. I felt so good. Coming down. Mm -hmm. Ooh. I was trying to get help of how to calm down. I was like, you guys, I don't even know how to explain it. You need to really feel it. To experience it, to understand it. So going down was good. I had to look up. I was like, what? Did I do this? Pat on my back, please. It was a fun and enjoyable moment. I had different activities. It was fun. I loved it so much. It was really interesting. So you guys like and subscribe and comment on this video. To help your girl out any little way that you can. I will, um, I really appreciate it. And, um, more videos. Saskatoon is a beautiful place. When I first came, probably when I heard about it, they were like, oh, it's a boring place. It's like a village. All falls. Saskatoon is beautiful. And I hope to explore more Saskatoon. Till then, and I'll see you guys later. Bye.